Hey guys, Zexus here, bringing you guys a hammer tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to cover hammer's true combos and the specifics needed to make them work. We'll be going over the Russian Mafia in this guide as well, so make sure you stick around for that. And the timestamps are down below. Hope you guys enjoy. The first combo we are going to cover is going to be the downlight into sidelight. Now this combo has no dex requirement and it's going to be true from 0 to 90 damage. Uh, this combo is going to do 26 damage and it does require a certain spacing. So at 0 damage right now, if I hit close up like that where the feet are overlapping, it is not going to work. But if I go back to about here where the feet are like touching, it is. And far away is going to work at every damage from 0 to 90. Now once you get to higher damages, close up is not going to work anymore. Like that. I have to hit it back quite a bit farther. So you're going to have to play around with that. Find out at which color whereabouts you're able to hit it from. So you know when to throw out this combo. Downlight into Gravity Cancel Neutral Light is going to be true from 0 to about 150 damage and has no dex requirement. This combo does 32 damage and you can do this from about stacked to about one of these pillars on ship away from the opponent. Now as the damage gets higher in this combo, you're going to have to wait a little longer on the Gravity Cancel Neutral Light. If you don't, it would look like this where the opponent would fall into it and then you would hit leaving a lot of dodge frames so you have to kind of go up and time this one so this one's going to take a bit of practice at different damages but if you work on it for a little bit you'll figure it out pretty quick downlight into jump turnaround dare is going to be true from zero to about 200 damage and has no dex requirement this combo does 26 damage and it's going to kill at 160 on ship. There we go. There's it true. Uh, the more damaged the opponent is, the more stacked you have to be for this combo to work. So for example, if I go down to 30 damage, I'll be able to hit it from about here. Okay, I was standing about here. If I go to higher damages, such as let's put 170, that's no longer going to work. So I have to be a bit more stacked like this there we go this combo also works to the point where you're a little past your opponent like that so that's also something to take note of you can also hit down light jump dare without the turnaround now to do this you're going to have to be a little bit farther away from the opponent and it's going to work from 0 to about 90 damage but it gets more inconsistent and more reliant on spacing at higher damages so right now Roland's at 50 damage. If I hit my downlight, I have to do a dash into a jump dare. So it looks like this. I'll put it in slow mo. You hit the downlight, then you do a dash by holding the down directional button and pressing your dodge or dash key into a jump and into dare. So if you still want to do the downlight dare to put them up so you can juggle with recoveries but you're farther away on the d light that's one way you can do that downlight jump side air is going to work from 20 plus damage and is a great kill combo on hammer it's going to do 30 damage and has no dex requirement it's also going to work at basically any spacing as long as you hit the downlight so i'll show you what i mean if you hit it stacked it's going to hit true, and if I hit it back here, I can also hit it true. This is going to be one of the most important uh, combos on hammer, so I definitely recommend you learning this one right away. Downlight into recovery is going to be true from about 110 plus damage, and it's going to deal 27 damage. It's going to be true on any decks. Uh, for the spacing, you need to be pretty close to stacked. If I hit it from back here, it's not going to work. I have, the legs basically have to be crossed and then your downlight recovery will work. Now quickly for this combo, because it's a bit different of an input, what you're going to do, you're going to do your downlight into a diagonal chase dodge towards the opponent like so. 
into your recovery. Boom, just like that. Looks pretty clean and it's going to be required that you learn this if you're going to want to learn the Russian Mafia later. Side air into neutral light is going to be true from 0 to 30 damage and is going to be consistent with 6 dexterity or higher. There are a couple specifics to make this one work though, the first one being that your Sarah has to be grounded and on a grounded opponent. The second one is going to be that you have to be close up to the opponent on the Sair. If you hit it from back here, you won't have time to get to the opponent. The third one is that after the uh, side air, you have to follow the opponent a little bit before throwing out your end light. To quickly show what I mean, if I do my side air and then don't hold the direction towards my opponent after, I'll just kick the air like so. If I hold towards, I'll move a little and be able to hit my neutral light. This combo is going to deal 42 damage. Side light into end light is going to deal 38 damage and is going to work on about 4 decks and up. Now for this combo it works a lot easier from a dash because it keeps some of your forward momentum. If you're just doing a run you'll generally push the opponent too far away from you. The side light also wants to be hit close up so that the opponent stays closer to you as well. This combo is going to work from white up until about mid yellow damage. The grounded Russian Mafia is going to be true from about 150 to 180 damage and has no dex requirement. If you can do the downlight recovery combo you should be able to figure this out pretty quickly but what we're doing here you're gonna be doing your D light recovery like we did before and then out of the D light recovery there we go D light chase dodge diagonal recovery into a turnaround down air so this combo looks super sick it's super styly um, once you get to higher com or higher damages sorry like if I get to 180 you're able to uh, kind of mix it up and instead of doing the dare you could hit a Sarah like that and at even higher damages like 210 ish you're able to hit a nair so the russian mafia not the most useful combo although it does kill like i said at 150 where if you do other combos like down light down air that's not going to kill and down light stair won't kill at this percent either you can also hit the russian mafia in the air and this also has no dex requirement so this one's really inconsistent and isn't the most applicable combo, but I'm going to show you it quick anyways. The reason it's not consistent is obviously because the damage required is going to be dependent on how high in the air your gravity cancel is. So uh, right now Zariel's at 180 damage and it's going to work at a full jump. Uh, quickly, just to show you the input, it is a tiny bit different than the uh, grounded one. So it looks like this. So gravity cancel D light into a chase dodge uh, horizontally towards the opponent. Into a recovery. Into our turnaround dare once again. So just like the grounded mafia, you are able to mix this up with side airs and such at higher damages. And yeah, it looks super cool. So if you hit this in game, you get tons of style points. So that's going to be the end of this tutorial. Hopefully you guys learned something new. If you did, hit that sub button and uh, turn on that bell so you get more notifications on guides and such. Uh, leave a comment with what weapons or character guides you want next. And make sure you check out all my social medias down below. Most uh, importantly, my Twitch channel where I try to help you guys as well. Hope you guys have a good one. Peace.